Welcome back to the channel. It's time to do some more of my GM mode. It's been a while since I've done this, like a, a super long while. I'm going to do something a little bit different this episode. We'll get to that once I start the actual show. But uh, yeah, right now the things I need to remember for today is Dominic Mysterio, boo, wants to appear in front of the crowd. So, you know, I'm always going to try and fulfill these requests. I have to ensure that my least popular available giant is in a match this week. So we're going to do that. The only thing I'm not going to do is I'm not going to do the backstage brawl. They are part of my season goals. I only need to do five of them. I'm show three of 25. I've already done... I want to say, I'm pretty sure I said like two. I'm pretty sure it's two that I've already done. They cost a lot of money. I didn't realize that. NXT is right on my butt. And then right after that, WCW is catching up, as you can see here. So I need to start like stretching that gap. We, 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 we got to go. We got to stay on top. I don't know if I'm going to use some power cards this week. I probably won't. But uh, we're, we're, we're getting there, right? We also hired Stone Cold. So I'm probably going to want to make use of him since he's under a legends contract uh, one thing we want to do is upgrade the arena do i want to get this uh, yeah i i think it's time now i can get the bigger arena i think we're gonna do it we're gonna buy it it's better right to do that so the crew i i can't do anything with the road crew it's the only thing i can do here so this is gonna cost me that all right so we got matches to book so first things first i gotta book a giant a giant's gotta be in here right so my only giant is actually Gunter. So we're going to put Gunter in a match and it automatically put him up against Randy Orton because he is actually in a rivalry with him at the moment. So we're going to leave it like that. Interferes, we're not going to put any. It's not going to be a titles match. We're going to go and we're going to save that. All right, next up, who do I want to do a self promo? Uh, maybe we get Stone Cold Steve Austin right this, this stone cold want to go out there it's kind of telling me though that these guys probably need it so you know what let's put our champion he's got a good one we're gonna send cody rhodes out there he's not gonna wrestle this week he's just gonna cut a promo yeah that's good that's gonna cost us a bit of money but that's okay it's gonna give him some stamina and that's what we want all right next up dominic mysterio wanted a match huh so maybe we do dominic mysterio stone cold steve Austin in a match against him we're gonna put a run in here and we're gonna actually have finn balor run in on stone cold steve austin right why not right i, I feel like that would be a good thing to do then uh we're gonna do some advertising i think uh yeah we're gonna do some advertising you know who needs some advertising right now it looks like they're telling me that her morale is bad so we're gonna give charlotte flair some advertising i think i want like a really fun match here uh so maybe we do a tag team match let's make it uh i don't know oh these cost money only thing that does it is normal so we're gonna do a triple threat normal match i think that's what we're gonna do instead we're gonna go like that it's too bad that i can't get more matches here we, we need to sign some more superstars i don't have a big roster here but maybe we put uh i don't know uh, it's tough i don't want to have a non-female card but i think it's gonna happen because we're gonna put these three in here unfortunately we'll have to Put the ladies on the next card i can't do it i gotta go like that because you know it, it's gonna cost me money uh hopefully this is the right thing to do i'm fulfilling these things here that's gonna be good for me with triple h triple h will be happy uh yeah confirm booking let's do it all right let's do it this week here is where things are gonna be different week one and week two i was actually playing the matches i don't want to simulate it I actually enjoy watching them as weird as that is. I prefer playing my GM mode that way you let me know. I already do it with OCW, right? So that's what we're going to do. We're going to spectate it from now on. I'm not going to get involved. I'm just going to spectate and we're going to see what the game does. That's what we're going to do. It's going to be a simulation of my GM. I'm literally just the GM. That's why I want to play GM mode that way. I'm literally just the general manager. I let the talent do that stuff. I do OCW, which is kind of similar. And then, of course, the uh, career mode that I'm controlling. So that's different. When I play universe mode on my own time, I do like to control it. But for my GM mode, I don't want to play it. I want it to run its course and 
do its thing. So here we go. We're going to spectate it. Gunter versus Randy Warren. Oh, look at this arena. We're in San Diego this week. Here comes Gunter. So do we think that uh, Drew McIntyre is going to take his title? Is that what everyone thinks? I think it might happen, to be honest. I think Drew's back now. If you didn't know that, if you didn't watch Money in the Bank. I agree. <laughs> Can Randy Orton take him out, though? That's That's the question here. Randy must be making a return soon. He must be. What a transformation this guy's done. A great intercontinental champion, too. Probably going to beat the Honky Tonk Man's record, I would think. He's, he's got to at this point, right? Oh, here comes the Viper. See, told you. I heard Michael Cole. I said that first. Just going to throw it out there. Oh, no. There's no more RK Bro. I'm telling you right now. When he comes back, RK Bro is done, bro. It's not happening anymore. Orton's getting ready here. He's, I don't know. The Giant might be the one to do it tonight, though. Or maybe this guy out of nowhere. What do you think of my card this week? Do you think I can win the ratings? Do you think it's going to happen? I have no idea. I'm kind of hoping it does, though. Randy's ready. I hope he. I, I want to see an RKO out of nowhere. I don't know if he's gonna win, but I'm the general manager. Right? I have to be biased here. I mean, unbiased. Oh my gosh, I'd be a terrible GM. <laughs> I'm really hoping. I put more money into this week, so hopefully we stay on top. NXT's like right behind me. All right, here we go. It's about to go down. Ring that bell. We're in a nice arena, at least now. Why does it say display controls? What can I control? Oh, you? I can move the cameras in GM mode, really? And it's not working. Oh, yeah, look at that. That's interesting. I can't do that in OCW. Oh, he's got him. Rope break. I kind of want to leave it like this, though, to be honest. That was cool, though. I got to admit it. Oh. Big boot. Gunther. He's got it. I don't know. He's starting to have full control of this match here. Not where you want to be if your name's Randy Orton. Against the ropes. And oh. Oh. Oh, he missed. This is the Viper's chance to get back into it if he wants it. Oh. 
I don't think that's enough. It was a two count, though. Uh-oh. This might be it. It's starting to look like the end to me. Oh, look at the squeeze. It's on like a vice grip. He's going to oh, pop his head. I think the Giants going to take it here. Just like he beat Matt Riddle. He's about to beat Orton, I think. Even the crowd just said that's it. They don't believe in Orton here. Is this it? Will Orton tap out? No, Orton's able to break free. Orin's out of it. Oh, wow. He's, Orin's got to get back into it. I'm just saying it right now. If he doesn't, Gunther's walking away with this match. Yeah, see, he's already reversing again. Oh, that's it. That's it. Is he going to do his power bomb now? Yeah. That's it. Game over, I think. One. Two. Oh, what? Randy Orton rolling to the outside. Such a smart move. No, he's not going to do it. Oh, what? Dude, Gunter right now, he's just destroying Orton. Oh, knee to the face. Reversal by Orton. Four. Yeah. Suplex. Oh, I hope this doesn't end in a count out. Anything but a count out, guys. Come on now. I might move OCW to uh, this arena. I'm kind of liking it, to be honest. Oh, this might be it, my friends. Oh, Orin's getting back into it. No, that's not enough. Orin, that's not enough, dude. Told you. Why you? Why is he taunting? Why is he taunting? Oh, he just ate that big boot. Can someone tell me why he taunted though? Oh no, that might be it. One, two, three. The General Gunter with the win. That's it. The Giant wins it. I need to get a bigger roster, though. That's, like, a priority. Mediocre? What do you mean mediocre? That was a good match. Come on. Why you got to do that to me, 2K23? That was not good. Yeah, I know. People said it was mediocre, though. All right. He had an okay promo, but his popularity didn't go up. Next up, we have, oh, you can only simulate this one. We have Dominic Mysterio, Stone Cold Steve Austin with a run-in from Finn Balor. Dominic Mysterio won, and it was disappointing. Charlotte Flair had an okay promo, but she lost popularity. That's not good. All right, here we go. Our last match, Brock Lesnar versus The Miz versus Sami Zayn. Here we go. So I did skip the entrances this time around, copyrighted stuff. You let me know though, if you want to continue to see entrances, I will make it happen. 
I honestly don't mind having the entrances on, but you let me know. Here goes the Miz. Sammy off the ropes. DDT. I have a feeling I'm going to do bad this week. I'm not going to lie. Uh-oh. No, no, no. Neck breaker by... We're getting into the pay-per-view soon too, right? Extreme Rules. Brock back in there. He's going to... Oh, I thought Brock was going to roll out. The Miz is gone. I don't know who's going to win. Do you think Sammy could win this? Oh, no. Under the ring. The Miz has a chair. I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised. Sammy able to break it, though. He's got him against the ropes. Oh, no. The Miz able to stop that chair shot. Oh, no. He's got him up. Brings him to the corner. Oh, he ate it. Close line by Sammy. Oh, the Miz is rolling out. No, never mind. He's not. Oh, he's busted open. Oh, yeah, it is a mess. Miz, you're going to pay for that, bud. I'm telling you. Oh, I thought he was going to do right on the chair. Well, the Miz is out. Suplex right on the chair. Brock Lesnar, though, gets hit with a DDT by Sammy. Miz, stop gesturing. Just get in the ring, dude. Oh, no, he's bringing in another chair. Reversal by Sammy. Able to stop the chair shot. Thrown right into Brock. Again with another right hook by The Miz. I'm not sure what uh, Sammy's doing here. He's got him over the ropes. Picking up Lesnar, though. Blue Thunder Bomb. Yeah. Watch out. Oh, Luva kick. Is that it? One, two, three. <laughs> yes. Yo, that could not have been a better finish. Yeah, you go, Sammy. Yo, that was actually good. I'm not going to lie. That got him. Blue Thunder Bomb, Haluva Kick. Good job, Sammy. Hopefully, the show this week was enough to uh, to beat and stay on top. That was an okay match. All right. It's time to see how we did. Yeah, Sammy Zayn. It was okay. All right, WCW. All right, so they did a false count anywhere match. One, two, it's over. Our truth won it, really, and they it was okay. Oh, that's not good. All right, so this looks like it's a title match. Yes, it is, and it's Ronda Rousey versus Dewdrop. Ronda keeps her title, and it was an okay match. Oh, crud. All right, then Veer Mahan versus Edge. Title match as well. Veer Mahan is the new champ. Oh, no, and there's an injury. Edge is injured for two weeks. Poor guy. Okay, over to Raw here. So title match, Dakota Kai versus Bianca Belair. Bianca stays in it. That was a great match. Oh, no, not good. MVP had an excellent promo. Fatal 4-Way, won by Carmella. Disappointing match. All right. Ivar called out Roman Reigns, and it was a weak promo. One, two, that's it. Ring the bell. 
Rig Boogs beat. All right, Bobby. NXT now. They're my rivals. They're number uh, two right now in the rankings. Rhea beats Nikki. All right. Asuka calls out Shayna, and it was a okay promo. Mid card, Austin versus Shinsuke. Austin wins it, and it was an okay match. Charity, Akira, embarrassing. Oof. All right, Dexter versus Grayson Waller. Grayson wins, and it was a great match. Oh, that's not good for me. That is not good for me. We're all below expectations, though. We got a free arena booking. That'll be good for the future. And look at that. I am still, thankfully, number one right now. Uh, Kurt Angle with Raw was able to outdo uh, NXT. NXT is now in third. But, I mean, they're not far behind, man. Like, we're talking just a couple thousand fans here. That's it. Eric Bischoff, though. WCW is in fourth place right now. Can Tyler Breeze and I continue to be first? I don't know. Looks like we are one week away from Extreme Rules here, though. All right, let's see what Triple H has to say. The big PLE is coming up soon. PLE weeks are the perfect opportunity to have big rivalries conclude and to use some of your power cards. All right. Sounds good. I already have a match card in mind. Got any advice on what I should be doing? Yeah, let's ask Triple H for some advice. He likes me, right? Just make sure you're planning for it. Get some rivalries ready and try not to injure your stars at the week before the big event. I even have this free arena power card for you. Use it next week if you're confident that the show you'll put on will be a great one. I'll be watching. End conversation. Thank you. I got two of these now. All right. My friends and family have been waiting so long to see me compete live in Newark. Can't wait to entertain them tonight. So she wants to have a match. Stone Cold. That loser Balor attacked me during the last fight. I'm not going to stand for garbage like that. I want to settle things in the ring with him. He wants to settle things with him in the next three weeks. So that's perfect. This means we can conclude that rivalry. Have Stone Cold do something else before he leaves again. So that that's good. Sounds good, Steve. All right. What's he going to say? Good. You mess with Austin, you pay the price. All right, so we got a bit of an increase. So that's where we're going to leave it for today. But I mean, listen, put in the comments down below. Let me know what you've thought of today's booking. And as always, for all your wrestling needs, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, turn on that notification bell, and I'll catch all you wrestle heads on the next one for some more wrestling content.